Hey everyone, it's Melissa. I guess you could tell by my intro that I am doing a vlog for the new year. So I kind of wanted to do vlogs periodically. I, I shy away from them some. I have done them some, but it just, I feel kind of vulnerable when I'm doing it because I'm walking around my house, showing my house. There's parts of my house that's very shabby. My my uh, couch in the very back room where I sit a lot, it's all torn up to pieces. I've shown it on Instagram before. I even duct tape it. And uh, we're, we're hoping someday to, you know, get us a, a good couch with good springs. And so that's why we haven't bought another one that's, you know, we want to invest in a really good uh, couch for Doug's back. So, you know, I showed that. Our kitchen hadn't been redone yet. So we're hoping, you know, in the next few years we can get some more renovations done on this old, old house. So I've, I've hesitated to show things like that because, you know, just walking around, you're going to see things like that because it just, I don't know, I'm afraid people are going to think we're trashy people. <laughs> Maybe we are. I don't know. But I thought it's time to stretch myself. It's time to grow and not let these things get to me. I am what I am and, you know. That's, that's what you'll see. But anyway, I've got lots of things planned this week. Uh, today, I have to go to the doctor in person, unfortunately. Tomorrow, I have a virtual doctor's appointment. I'm going to have to go to the office probably tomorrow. And Doug has two employees. I have not been to the office in nine months. But I'm going to have to go tomorrow to do the W-2 forms, the year-end taxes for state and federal and, you know, everything else in between. So i got to get that done. I've got to return some items that for presents that didn't fit people. So I'm going to do that. I thought the place where I go to return, you know, to mail things, it's a mail mailbox pickup thing. And you can just stick it right inside there. You don't have to have contact with people. But while I was over there, I thought I would show you what kudzu looks like in the wintertime. Kudzu is a plant that we have here in the south. It just, it's a, it looks like a, almost looks like ivy, but it encircles everything and just eats it up. And it looks like something from a science fiction movie. If I've got a picture that I put on Instagram, I'll show you right now what it looks like in the summertime. But I thought I would show you what it looks like in the wintertime and what it does to the trees that it leaves behind. And then it comes back again the next summer because that's over there where I mail. gonna go do some packing up and then we'll get going and thank you for watching I appreciate it So as you can see, I still have a couple of trees up. I can't bring myself to bring them down. I love that little tree with everything on it. I really do. I will take it down. And the same with this one in here. And then I have one in the back room where Doug and I watch TV. I just really like them. I'm gonna keep them up just a little bit longer. It, they just, they just make me happy. So I think my daughter and I are going to walk around that neighborhood a little bit and I'll show you a little bit of that without showing house numbers or anything like that. Just kind of a general. A couple of houses in this neighborhood have been renovated. People are really doing a great job on it and kind of trying to bring the neighborhood back to life. So that's exciting. I'll show a little bit without being intrusive and uh, that'll be fun. First, I'm gonna show you our yard, what it looks like in the winter time. You might hear sawing two doors down there's a huge house renovation going on. And I see our neighbor's cat. 
our next door neighbor that moved here and is renovating a house right next door on the other side. When he moved in, he, uh, or about a few months ago, he adopted two cats and they are the cutest thing. The female, she's over here all the time. Let's see if I can get a shot of her. She's over here all the time, there she is. But she will knock that male. She will slap him <laughs> if he walks by. Hey, sweetie, kitty, kitty, kitty. I can't remember what her name is, but she's a cutie pie. And this vine here just, Doug has to cut it back all the time. You can hear all the work they're doing over there at the house. It's going to be a major renovation. <laughs> she's sneaking by me. Um, it's going to be a major renov renovation, but this vine has to be cut back all the time. On It just grows up that porch constantly. So this is the yard in the winter time the fountain uh it does freeze here so doug puts the fountain away kind of boards it up in the winter time and that little statue there that was given to me when my mother died it's an angel looking after a little girl just the big trees i'll show them January in Tennessee. That house is really going to be something. Well, both houses are, but that one two doors down, I mean, they are really doing it upright. In fact, I'll show, when my daughter and I walk, I'll show you a picture from the front, just a casual picture, and then I'll show you a picture at night. They have lights on at night and the, their stained glass windows and doors will light up. It's so pretty. So I'll take you back in now. Here's a house that is, that is really being worked on. Don't want to get a new dress or anything like that, but boy, are they really, let me show you the side. I'm going to show it at night because those stained glass windows are lit up at night. It's beautiful. They're really doing a lot of work on the side and on back. I like these alleys. They're so cute and they just seem to be something that you don't find so much anymore. They go all the way down the street. It's parallel to the street I live on. Some more alleyway. It just goes all the way down and it's so pretty. It's so charming, I think. It's going to be pretty.
Thank you so much for watching. Oliver, thanks you for watching. Everybody have a good couple of days and talk to you soon. Bye-bye.